What's up everyone? This is YouTube Ken. I'm back with another video. I just wanted to make a video uh, to show you how I charge my Tesla. There's a couple options that you do have. You can charge with a regular outlet. You should get around three to five miles, I believe. And also you can get a NEMA 1450 outlet installed, 50 volts. And that would definitely uh, charge it around 30 to 34 miles an hour. I wanted to just go over this video and just let you know how I uh, charge. Most of you, if you follow me, you already know. I'll show you first. I have the uh, mobile connector. If you all don't know about the mobile connector, um, it's basically this right here. And I'll show it to you closer. That's pretty much the main uh, source what you're gonna need whenever you do a charge from home. This part down here is what you plug into your car. You can also buy the wall connector from Tesla, which is $500. Some people can't afford that. So um, you can definitely go my way and get a 50 volt 1450 outlet installed in your garage. It might be a little bit cheaper depending on where you're located and their rates. Tesla provides two adapters with the purchase of your car and they give you just a regular um, regular outlet that you can plug into most outlets, uh, especially here in the United States, and also a J1772 adapter. I'll show you both of them up close. So the adapter that I had to buy from Tesla, I think it was like $30. The adapter for the 1450 outlet, the 50 volt, but I'll show you that also up close of how that looks. So I pre-recorded the video that I'll add to this video where uh, just a regular outlet um, plug and how much you know basically it will charge your car it charged it around three miles per hour which is not a lot especially if you need some juice and you're running out of uh, time you need to charge up and go get on the road that really just depends if you are commute a very long way I would say I don't commute a long way but I still wanted a, a charging source that is fairly fast. So then basically I unplugged the regular wall adapter for the regular outlets. Then I recorded to show you the 1450 that I charge with every day and how much speeds that I did get. And then I plugged in the 1450 into my 50 volt outlet that I got installed. And I got, I believe, around 30, 31 miles, maybe 33, I cannot remember. But on average, I honestly get 34 miles an hour, which is pretty good. I think you can get up to about 50 miles if you get the wall connector from Tesla for $500. I just couldn't justify that. I rent my place, so. So I just wanted to make uh, a video to show you how I charge my car here at home. Um, leave me a comment of how you charge yours. Do you have the wall connector and balling like that? Or do you just charge by the regular outlet that Tesla provides to you? Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Please like, comment, subscribe to my channel. There will definitely be more content with my Tesla. If you have any questions, please let me know. If you are buying a Tesla, 
now or in the future, if you need a referral code, I will put my referral code in the description below. All right, I'm done. All right, it's over. This is YouTube Ken. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.